Good afternoon, Richard. You're through to Matthew at GC Motors in Harrogate. Thank you very much for your inquiry on our stunning Land Rover Discovery. I'm uh, going to do a video presentation of the vehicle just to give you a bit of an idea of the condition, etc. I thought I'd start by showing you a bit of our showroom, just give you an idea a bit about who we are and what we're about. So we've got some nice pieces of kit in the showroom at the moment. Probably the most expensive, in fact the most expensive, at an eye water in £280,000 is the 675LT, which I'm sure you'll agree does look absolutely stunning. There we have prancing through Imran, our pitch coordinator, making the pitch look beautiful and Hello, stunning. How are you? Happy birthday, Matthew. Thank you, Imran. It is my birthday today, Richard, just in case you were wondering. Uh, we've got a beautiful Aventador, the Vanquish, a few, few McLarens, probably a bit more than most McLaren dealers, but hey ho, we have the largest sports and prestige dealer in the country. Inside sports and prestige dealership, sorry. So here we have GC Motors in the flesh in not so sunny Harrogate. It has been sunny today, but it is North Yorkshire. The clouds do come. Start by showing you our Pierre Resistance, which is the Aventador SV, which is going out today. It was our most expensive car until it recently sold. So, as I mentioned, we are the largest sports and prestige single site dealership in the UK. We currently have about 120 cars on site, which roughly equates to just over £10 million pounds worth of stock. So, as you can see, we've got a few, we've got a few cars there. Range Rovers, G-Wagons, the 4x4s, we pan right, we see a bit more sporty cars, so the E63, RS6, the X5. Got beautiful Jaguar F-Type SVR there, BMW i8, mixing it up with a bit of the hybrid. But what we're all here to see, and the car that you did inquire of, is the beautiful Land Rover Discovery 4. Just pan out there for you. Now the purpose of this video, Richard, is I want to show you a bit about the condition of the vehicle. Now having walked around this vehicle earlier, I can assure you it is in absolutely great condition. As you can see, more or less no stone chips. There's a small amount there. Small stone chip there, absolutely minute. As you can see the front of the vehicle, very, very nice condition. We have recently invested one million pounds in a state-of-the-art body shop where we guarantee no scratches to the paintwork, no little dinks, scuffs or marks to the alloy wheels. We do have our very own wheel refurbishment centre which is one, of our, is one of our most specialist facilities where we, for example, powder coat wheels, we've got an £85,000 diamond cutting facility, anything you need really to bring a, a wheel back to its best. So the car is currently on its upgrade alloys which start at about £2,500 but do make the car stand out and look absolutely stunning. So if we have a quick look around the back of the car as you can see no marks of the paintwork there. I'll just get pan out for you, I'll pan out for you Richard now. This car really looks beautiful from the back. We are a Land Rover specialist so we do use genuine Land Rover approved parts. We do use genuine Land Rover diagnostic equipment that you would find at a Land Rover factory and we also have a Land Rover dealership trained technician who would carry out any work that has to be done on this car. Which all used cars do need preparation which I'm sure you're aware. So if we just have a look at the condition of the car, as you can see door sills, that no scratches on the door sill there and the footwell is in very nice condition. Now the car has done 14,688 miles so the leather has been sat in but I'm sure you agree the condition of the leather is very good, as with the leather on the armrest. And if we just have a quick look at the centre console, no marks to the centre console. Jump in the car for you now, Richard. And there we go, start the engine for you. There we go. Now, if we just pan to the back of the car, there we go, we've got the tailgate, so I'll just pop that open. And if we have a quick look in the car, obviously we have got the E7 seats. If we look at the back of the car, it's in nice condition. Let's have a look at the three seats at the rear once again. The leather does look like it's very rarely being sat in. And if you just pan around to the passenger side. Leather in lovely condition there. 
Thank you for your inquiry with us, Richard. Pop this video across to you on email. I'll let you have a watch, have a think, and then I'll give you a call later to discuss. Thank you. Bye-bye.